It's another week and another chic. The Daily Beast piece on New York Times fashion critic Kathy Horn was juicy. Our darling Kathy dissed Tommy Hilfiger's 25th anniversary bash, reiterated that she thought Alexander Wang's show was boring, and said she hopes fashion's night out doesn't continue. Someone's not going to like that. The latest issue of Star Magazine, uh, W, has Kim Kardashian au naturel on the cover of the art issue. Naturally, when one thinks of art, she's the first thing that comes to mind. <laughs> Model Lara Stone graces the cover of British Vogue and reveals some interesting facts. One, she's terrified of interviews and says she'd much rather get naked in front of a camera. Two, she never gets recognised on the street and she likes it that way. And three, she's not ready for kids quite yet, but would like to have little gay boys because she's terrified of little girls. On Tuesday night, the Cinema Society hosted the premiere of Hilary Swank's much-buzzed-about film Conviction. Based on a true story, Swank's character goes to law school to defend her brother, played by Sam Rockwell, who was wrongfully convicted of murder. Hilary fills us in on her character. I was compelled by the, the beauty and the tenacity and grace and selflessness of this woman. You know, against all odds came out the other side and was just sheer strength and will. Since our mind was in a legal mode, we asked some of the stars of the film if these wacky laws were true or false. In Baltimore, it is illegal to take a lion to the movies. False. True. No, it is not. You get out of town. That's ridiculous. Why would they have that law? In Lexington, Kentucky, it's illegal to carry an ice cream cone in your pocket. That wouldn't surprise me. If that was actually a law. That's also true. It's true, isn't it? It's too eccentric not to be true, yeah. How feared is Kathy Horn? We went to the center of the universe, Times Square, for a special Kathy Horn investigation. What do you think this lady does for a living? She's probably a model. She's a teacher? Well, she's got a pen in her hand, so she's probably a director or an editor or something like that. She's probably a judge. She's all dressed in black, so she must be from New York. And then we wanted to know, do you fear Kathy? No. She wouldn't be someone I'd probably walk up and approach, but I could talk to her. Should I be scared? <laughs> Very pretty. She looks like she may have a kind of wicked sense of humor, actually. <laughs> no, but I think she could be a force to be reckoned with if you get on the wrong side of her. You look at her eyes. Behind her eyes is somebody there that want to be loved, that want to be hugged. The people have spoken. There's nothing to fear. For more fashion headlines, dailyfrontrow.com is the place to go. See you next week.